To add effects like reverb and delay, we need to set up an auxiliary and bus our sounds to that auxiliary. If I come to my mixer page and create a new track, I'm going to add reverb this time and I'm going to add a stereo reverb. So I make my track stereo and instead of an audio track I make it an auxiliary input. It just means it's an open track which I don't have to put into record to listen to what's being sent to it. I then create that channel. I'm now going to label it. And now <clears throat> add an insert which is going to be our reverb on that channel. So now I have my reverb on that channel and now I need to send things to it and pick up an input into it. So at the moment I have no input. If I come down and use my bus, I can pick up bus 1, 2, which is my input coming into this channel. And now to send our sounds to it, I need to come up and set a bus up on the channels that I want to send my sounds from. So I'm going to use bus 1, 2, which is the one I'm picking up into reverb, and put it on, put it on my um, kick drum and snare drum channel here. I'll then play it through and add the reverb. Adding reverb on the kick drum, I click on my bus send, I see my fader value here, if I turn it up, I can add loads of reverb to it, or any amount that I want to, and then to add it to the snare drum as well, click on the snare drum, bus, turn it up, and now I can get my reverb on my kick drum and snare drum. I could add this to as many different instruments as I wanted, and we, I would just be using one reverb there.